What the fuck is up with the disco room? Ah, uh, okay. I, I see. There you go. Ha happy birthday. I said, Mr. Spear said, happy birthday. Okay, cool. Happy birthday. Fuck off. <laughs> well, at least we got some music to listen to while uh, Peach fumbles with her Streamlabs. I don't know. Hey, I'm not the one that told you to switch to Streamlabs, now did I? Well, there's that. <laughs> All right, so again, I was just informed that the whole reason this disco shits here is because of that whole uh, anniversary slash birthday thing. It's a lot of flashy lights, so if you're an epileptic, I'm sorry. If you have Tourette's, you're fucking welcome. <laughs> Corvus types rave so I can only imagine him dancing his ass off to this shit <laughs> which means I gotta I gotta number one imagine what you look like and then number two imagine you're dancing to this shit so. <laughs> yeah absolutely oh Jesus Christ we got party hats on too All right, okay, so that way if I get lost in the house, I just follow the first random cone head I see. I got it. Or what, dunce? <laughs> I, I, I was going to say, I, I, decided, I decided to be nice about it. I said, uh, for what, dunce, I was going to say, for what, douchebag? I mean... <laughs> Holy fucking Moses. What like the little the little black ones with the red? Is that what I'm looking at? Here? Do they do we at least move fucking faster? Yeah. You all are like already ahead of me. I'm trying to figure out what the fuck I'm supposed to be using here. What the hell? Oh, and the temp gun is now blue, I see. Okay.
Oh, okay, this fucking house. Woo! That's a bright fucking light. Hello there. All right, you can prove nothing and you're not allowed to ask my wife. What's, <laughs> What's your favorite room? The one with the chains. Four point six, ten point five, six point nine. Ten point nine. Hey, Paul, make sure it's not a steering wheel. Oh, sorry, was that too soon? Actually, I don't believe he... I don't believe he was the driver in that particular case. The one with the chains! Hello. Up three point one right in here so far. Oh hey, yeah, go talk to yourself, motherfucker. I am out of here. Hello. Ah, ha, ha. It's right behind me, he wants me. God damn, that sounded like me this morning when I woke up. Because he's rubbing it too fast. That's a, that was his cause of death. One too many Viagra pills. Um. B. Son of a bitch. Feeling like I'm playing this game for the first time all over again. Fuck this. Okay. <laughs> Once upon a time, there was a fucking ghost. His name wasn't Casper, and he spooked all of our fucking asses. Ah, damn it! Leave me alone! Now this bitch is all gurgling. Ah! 
That's that that's about standard apparently. <coughs> Over by the washer and dryer where we hid before. I shall go and monitor everything. But Jerry's on! Yeah, you guys did get all the main objectives. I oh, figured that out. All right, viewers, I died. Get used to it. It's going to happen a lot. But then again, if uh, you all sat there and invited me to go actually to actually go ghost hunting, I'd end up showing up with fucking a 30 pack of beer, a half ounce of reefer, and a deck of playing cards. <laughs> Holy, what the fuck happened to the, 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 the damn journal? Yeah, I heard you guys say the book was different, and I'm like, okay, the book's different. And so you guys got a spirit box, okay. Do we have any other... Wow. Hey. He, he he was sniffing your hair. <coughs> Damn it, sorry. Okay, okay. I would say you can go ahead and poke my dead body all you want, but then again, with the exception of anything anal, but I'm dead, so therefore I don't really have anything to say. <laughs> I mean, I'm pretty sure that the body's cold by now, no sense in using the rectal thermometer. I mean, you know, anyway. No, no, no. I'm not even wheezing right now, so it's definitely in game. Just because you have those party hats on, don't mean you can stick it up my ass. Stop it. Garage. Uh. 
You guys got an activity level of 10 right now. Peach is insane. What else is new? I'd fucking shit if one day we did that and the ghost came back over the Luigi board saying I'm on welfare. Might be illiterate, man. Give it a break. It's hungry. I have no idea. I... I Now that you gave me You see it. Sounds like he got a bad picnic basket, boo boo boy. Y'all are fucking lucky we're not actually doing a real ghost hunt and actually trying to make contact with my brother because instead of, hey, you would get, you want to touch my wiener? <laughs> I, I got it, yeah. We would have bonfires every week, and whoever the new guy was standing by the fire, he'd walk up next to him, put his arm around him, look over and be like, Hey, pal, want to touch my wiener? <laughs> Oof, burp. Oof. I see the inside of somebody's head. I mean, I like head and all, that's just not what I had in mind. What's sad about that is your 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 avatar character actually looks like a family member of mine. <laughs> no, I meant like an actual blood relative. Um, listen, what happens? What happens on your monthly cycle is none of my fucking business, Bond. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Hey! Can't fire me. Give me a damn break, all right? My nose, my ears are clogged, okay? Fucking give me a fucking break. <laughs> uh, a, f a few Viagra and a nudie magazine and we are in business. What happened to the standard video camera? 
Okay. Ay, 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 ay. Oh, Mr. Krabs left Discord? Bye, Krabs. I didn't want you anyway. Can't afford the ointment. Okay, it gives a fuck. I care about everybody in the community, but the main people I really care about are right here, so, you know. Yes, Peach, I shall inflate that ego. I was going to say, yeah, Peach, I'll stroke that ego, and I just had this funny feeling that you were going to come back with this owl you're going to stroke. <laughs> Listen, you're going to have to file... You're going to have to file a personal request with my wife in triplicate before that can even happen, okay? Uh... Oh, really? Well, you know what? Let me go buy a new camera and we're in business. Look, I ain't been on in a while. I have to be an obnoxious motherfucker right now. I love the way that it sounded like somebody was just taking a piss and nobody, nobody reacted to it whatsoever. <laughs> oh. Let me step out here and adjust the uh, journal. So we got fingered and somebody drew. Okay. <laughs> I'm still going to try to get some temperature reading in here. Yeah. Just for shits and giggles. Well, I was in Amsterdam, haunting that place up, but then you summoned my ass. What do you want, bitch? <laughs> if it says I'm in the basement, I am fucking running. Ain't a, ain't a goddamn thing about this game foreign, so I don't even understand why Are You French is an actual fucking... <laughs> No, I do not want to become famous. I'm already semi. Let's see what else I got in my inventory. What the fuck is this little box thing? Is this like the new spirit box? Uh, I don't seem to be able to turn the damn thing on. Uh, it, it, it looks like a half-rounded fucking box that kind of resembles one of those bitches from Among Us. Um.
Have we figured out exactly like what area it might be? And you can't even look at that whole play with litter box thing as being weird either, honey. Okay. What happens every time we change the litter boxes in this house? What are these things that look like fucking whole milk? Oh. <laughs> All right, I got a funny fucking story. This is actually a fucking true story. When I was in high school, we were all hanging out after school one day. Uh, like, they had, like, the study hall, like, in the cafeteria after school from, like, I think it was, like, 4 to 6 or whatever. And at some point, we were doing a health class, like, thing, for, like, all working on it together. And the little factoid that come... Is ejaculated at like the equivalent of 60 miles per hour came up in the study, which one of my friends promptly went to the payphone, called 1 800 Dennis, and said that they needed help with a chipped tooth. And they said, that, How okay, how'd you chip your tooth? And they were like, Well, the last thing I did was give my boyfriend head, so I figure. If cum comes out of 60 miles per hour, it's enough to chip a tooth. True fucking story. I really wish I was making that up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, so did the person on the other end of the line. I mean... <sighs> that broke a lamp. This is the what's this? And whatever. Keep in mind, I graduated in 99, so shit like that was hilarious. Um, shut up, Peach. Thank God we didn't have GP back then. We'd have to call it Romper Room. Alright, hey Dad, where's the litter box in the mansion? Or Sesame Street, depending on what you grew up watching. For some odd reason, that fucking makes sense. Who didn't watch Jerry Springer? Bunch of trailer park trash fucking duking it out. Yeah. I married this jackass named Cletus and I call him fucking my daughter Betty Sue. Sir, why are you on the show today? Because I am my own grandpa. Hey, Corvus, I don't know if you'll remember this show. But it was a show on MTV 
called the state. The state. There was a guy that was on there, and no matter what anybody said, his reaction was, I want to dip my balls in it. And then, uh, later on, this other skit was transferred to Mad TV, but Stewart. Um, it was like a kid with like special needs or whatever, and like every time he was yelling, Heck no! Leave me alone! Yeah. And then it was, um, like after a while he'd be like, Look what I can do! And he can just do like this weird fucking dance or whatever. <laughs> I mean, on the state, it was like really. Uh, I guess the word for our us at that time was risque, but on Mad TV it was kind of watered down. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey dad what are these papers nope 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 oh, I'm gonna die <laughs> oh my god that's fucking freaky dad what are these papers oh, oh god damn it what are these? No, I stepped outside for a fucking smoke. Okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ. After hearing that fucking crying in my ear, I need to have it out of a fucking smoke. Jesus. They never had that the last time I played it. <laughs> But yeah, to answer your previous question, Peach, um, when we're done here, if you guys want to continue playing like Dead by Daylight, that's awesome. Uh, all I ask is that you stream so I can continue to make fucking weird-ass commentary. <laughs> I'll slug back a couple beers, you know. Dad, what do these papers mean? Actually, now I, I I've I've been actually drinking liquid death um, water um, since I've been under the weather, but normally it would be beer. <laughs> It's an alcoholic drink that people usually drink when they really have... <laughs> um, no, my daughter was on the mansion level of the cat game and she just walked across the piano. <laughs> hey, look... It, it, the kitchen. That was perfect, though, I have to say. <laughs> uh, Dad, where's the kitchen? <laughs> oh, you guys got level 10 activity somewhere. Dad, where's the kitchen? I'm sorry, honey. Oh. I, I can't really hear you with both of those earbuds in my ear. Found it. You gotta catch two, uh, three more butterflies. I know. Okay. Okay. I'll shut up. You're getting to be at that age where you don't need my help. 
No. <laughs> I'm just kidding, funny. <laughs> Confirmed or unconfirmed? <laughs> Cook me. I am very fucking happy to say that I've actually had military experience and still to this day the only people I've killed have been in video games. Peach, um, if you really talk to all the rest of my friends, you're going to find out that you guys don't really have very much in common when it comes to how many people I've killed. Dead look. Dead. Meaning you're probably the only person I've ever fucking killed when it comes to my friends. Guess where um, I am. You're inside the oven. How can I turn it on? I turn it on, Dad? You don't turn it on, honey. You're not supposed to make fucking kitty burgers. You're just fucking... <laughs> God, I'm, I can't talk like that in front of you. I'm sorry. Oh, can I stab myself? What is your obsession with freaking violence? <laughs> oh, wait, you're my daughter. That explains it. I mean, Wait, I, I don't know why I'm surprised. At her age, I've done seen the first six uh, freaking Friday the 13th and at least the first four Nightmare on Elm Street. Yeah, so that's I have. what I have. <laughs> that's mildly disturbing. You have a knife in your mouth as a cat and you're running around the house. Wait, where did he go? And the game starts off talking about how pissed off you are at your owners for some reason or another. <laughs> and you can pick on the uh, side. Jesus. <gasps> Wait, that's not what I want. Then again, if my Rolla ever came running through the house with a knife in her mouth, I was going to be like, yep, she's going to kill Merlin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know, if you ever go in there and you're talking to a ghost that died in, like, the freaking 1700s, I don't think that phrase is going to have any relevance. There we go. I think at that point you'd have to sit there and be like, I'm here to talk about your horse's extended warranty. You owe us a couple of glasses of fucking whiskey. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I don't think that's going to work. Who knows? It might not. Alrighty, let me go ahead and look the yeah, I'm going to show you. Yeah. <coughs> Wait, what? Unless I created a trend, you shouldn't be by yourself. I found nothing spot. What other, what's the other evidence? I'm sorry. We picked the knife back up. Cool, cool. Tremendous urge to watch Clerks. Hey, Dad, can you just start filming like a little short? Yeah. 
Oh, you should start making shorts with Bob YouTube. Oh shit, what up? <laughs>